Hi, everybody. This is Sherry Leopold with Outside the Box with Sherry, and I have a delightful treat for you today. I have Lydia Lukic, who is a mindset coach and an amazing person. I absolutely know her personally, and it's such a gift. Thank you, Lydia, for joining us today. Thank you, Sherry. So honored to be with another like-minded entrepreneur with her glowing, beautiful smile <laughs> on this Monday morning. Hi, everyone. So like Sherry said, I'm Lydia. I'm known as the Limitless Mindset Coach who works with other entrepreneurs and empowers them to achieve their highest success. And how I do that is with my online program via coaching tools that I provide. So that's what I do via Zoom. I love that. And you know, it's, and you know that because we are entrepreneurs, we attract entrepreneurs as well. And I think that's one of the things that I love about you is you want other entrepreneurs to win just like I do. And really, and I know you have your own special thing that you do that you shine a light on uh, amazing women that is on Fridays. Can you tell us what that's called and how that came to be? For sure. Yeah. So um, when I initially started my business, it was oriented toward female entrepreneurs. And now I've gotten more audience of male and female. So like you said, I'm rebranding a little bit, empowering all entrepreneurs because we all have a mindset. So um, the Fridays, I call it gratitude attitude. So one of my key values is gratitude and how important it is. And with so many distractions, we get so caught up, you know, and forget the things that we do have, like the air that we breathe roof over our head, everything like that, the wonderful people we know, like yourself, right? And what I decided to do is really lead by example and demonstrate my gratitude attitude. So what I decided to do is every Friday on Facebook Lives, because that was getting popular, um, I highlight powerhouse women. And this is literally to honor each female entrepreneur and to highlight them and to thank them because every person that I've met really taught me something and everyone has something to give. And that's what I really believe in all our unique gifts. So I decided to pay that forward and show my gratitude. So I call it gratitude attitude Fridays. And like I said, now I'll be incorporating probably in the new year, Kings and Queens, so it'll be men and women. So I'm pretty excited. Oh, I love that. that. <laughs> and you know, the thing is, I, I love that you're doing that because it's a lot like what I do here with Outside the Box with Sherry yeah. is where I really love shining a light on people who are doing those extraordinary things in the world. And really it's with a servant heart. And I know that that is you as well. And that's why you're sitting here and I'm shining a light on you. Um, I know that your the name of your business is Limitless with Lydia. Can you give us a little insight into what that means to you to be limitless? Yes, for sure. Great question. Um, yes, so definitely Limitless with Lydia. So I'll tell you a little bit of a story. So initially, when I started my business, I was like, I'm going to call it Level Up with Lids. And Lids is my nickname that only my close friends know me by. And then as I started doing more branding and everything and talk to a few people, they're like, Lydia, you really want to stand out and differentiate yourself. So what do you want other people to know about you, about your business? How do you want them to make, how do you want to make them feel? And I was like, I just want everyone to know they're limitless. And, and the meaning behind that word, obviously we all know what limitless means, no limits no boxes. However, it's more meaningful than that. So how I discovered the power of growth mindset and being limitless and thinking limitless is, um, so as a little girl, as you know, Sherry, we've been in the same mentorship group. Um, I grew up in fear, right? And um, my father was very controlling towards my mother. And I had to watch that as a child. And I really lost all my power. I couldn't do anything. Couldn't. I just stayed quiet and listened and just there I was, little Lydia, right? And um, over the years, um, I have really discovered the power of the mind in action. And it wasn't until I really invested in myself and started reading books, getting mentors and learning about it, but not only learning, it was only literally the last two years that I really, really put in massive action, right? And when I recognized the power of our mind combined with action, like how much we can change our entire world and our life. It was mind blowing. Um, and that's what really pushed me to start my business during COVID. So I named it Limitless because 
honestly, there is no, there are no limits. That's my quote. Only the ones we create, everything you need is within you. And, you know, even before when I was younger, I was like, yeah, whatever. People are just being cheesy. Like, oh yeah, I just think positive, whatever. However, the key is not just thinking it. So there's a, a belief, a set of values that you have every day. Everything that you do is a belief and a decision, right? Um, but limitless means not allowing the outside factors, the fear, the approval from others, judgments, opinions, all these things beat you up. So that's self-sabotage. So really starting with yourself and, and leading yourself to be that unique gift that you are and impact the world in a positive way. So that's my mission for every entrepreneur to tap into their unique gift and then pass that forward. And we all united make that big impact on the world. So it's no longer about me. It's limitless. It's this whole power when we're all united together each one providing our unique gift, that's where the true power lies. So that's what the limitless mindset is. Like you can achieve anything, but consistency, action and perseverance is key. And that's where most entrepreneurs give up. They quit because either someone, they told them that their dream is not true or they can't do it or they beat themselves up. And I've been one of those people. I'm not saying I'm perfect. I'm just giving you an example of what limitless is. And once you continue and persevere through all those situations, you grow you get stronger and that's where the true power lies. And that's what limitless is really about. I love that so much. There's so many nuggets in there. Yeah. And, and I, I completely 100% agree that most people quit on themselves. That's why they never quite reach where they want to go is because they quit too soon or they're not consistent or both. And when you're not consistent, it makes it way easier to quit. Yeah. I mean, that, that's, that's what that is. So would you sort of, uh, like you did with Limitless, would you give us an idea of what you, um, how you identify what the word mindset actually means? Yeah, for sure. So mindset is a set of beliefs that we all have, right? And, um, and anyone who studied, you know, mindset or what it is, there's a fixed mindset and a growth mindset. And what the difference between two is, again, I'm leading to Limitless, <laughs> And empowering everyone. But um, really, the true difference is growth mindset is when you're willing to learn, um, you don't think that someone's just talented, basically, you can learn any skill and you truly believe if you put in the work and effort that you can achieve anything you want. A fixed mindset, and we're usually a combination of both, like I, I have a fixed mindset on things that I'm working on, right? So we all have it a combination of both, but um, a fixed mindset. And that's where really people get stuck that just that mindset takes over is when you just think mm, yeah there's nothing I can do the world sucks like I can't do anything that person's just talented they're lucky they have everything in their life so really what a mindset is is, is your set of beliefs and the system that you create in your head so every day when I wake up there is a decision I make. Like you say, it's all about the choices. And I agree. I say that all the time. It's all about those choices we make. And those choices and that attitude that we set up for the day comes from here. That's what our mindset is. So really, everything starts with your belief system and then the action you take. So that's really what a mindset is to me. And, you know, I, I'm often heard saying choices create change. And I know you've heard me say that before yeah. as well. And the thing is, we make those choices based on that set of beliefs, you know, yes. and I think that in and of itself, uh, and I, I can tell you nothing probably makes me freak out more than when I hear somebody say, well, there's nothing I can do. Ah, mm -hmm. <laughs> there's everything you can do. Just change yes. the words. There's everything. I can do anything. <laughs> yes. and, like your whole world will change because everything will follow that thought, mm -hmm. you know, it's literally whatever it is you believe to be true, whether there's a lick of fact in it or not, uh, it, it propels you, right? And your actions yeah. follow it, whatever you, you talk about. Now, I know that you have a, a gift for our watchers of Outside the Box with Sherry, and I'm excited about that because I believe it goes along really well with like what we're talking about with having that limitless yeah. mindset. Um, and it actually is one of the key things that you can start your day off the right way with. So can you share what your gift is for our viewers? For sure, I will. I just wanted to add one more point for the last conversation. We were talking about the mindset and how when you said when people go, I can't do anything about it. Another thing is the focus. You should focus on things you have control over. 
right? And a lot of people tend to focus on outside factors and something where they really can't create an impact. So that's where it starts. The first thing you have control over is yourself and your attitude and then how you go through the day. So that's just another thing I want to throw out there. Another focus on things you have control over. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but now about the gift. Yes, thank you. So if uh, your viewers go to my website, meet Lydia, L-Y-D-I-A.com, I have a free gift. It's a PDF file that I created. Um, it's called Elevate Your Day Morning Routine. And I really, like I said, uh, mentioned how everything starts with you and the, how you set up your day for success. So really having a set of routines and then when those routines are consistent, they become a habit. And those are those healthy habits that I really talk about all the time. And they're crucial to your success and well-being physically and mentally. So um, if they go on my website, they can get that gift and use some of those steps. And I hope it serves them well. So yeah, definitely it goes with awesome. <laughs> setting you up for success. So I hope they enjoy it. Oh, I love that so much. And I do think it's really important what you start your day with, whatever thoughts that you start your day with. You know, yeah. some people pray, some people meditate. Um, I kind of start my day with the, I am an unrepeatable miracle and I will use the gifts that God has given me to bless the world. Like that's what I start my day with. And so I know that when I go into my day, everything that I have been gifted with, the skills, the talents that I have, I'm going to show up that day and use them to bless and impact the world. And it's just, I know one of my friends, she says, you know, it's a great day to be on planet earth. Uh, you know, so like it, it really does impact um, and it's going to be different for everybody, but I mm -hmm. do think that that is going to be a really useful um, tool for people to understand that impact uh, um, mm -hmm. and that thought process and getting your day started right. So I really appreciate you um, sharing that with us. Now, if somebody wants to work with you because their maybe their mindset isn't as limitless as they would like it to be, can you share with us a little bit about the ways people work with you and how they can connect with you? Most definitely, yeah. So obviously social media, as we know, so limitless with Lydia. You can find me on Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn, everything. So, um, but my website is the best because it really shows everything about me and what I do and my mission and all of that. So again, it's meetlydialydia.com. And um, usually people either message me, direct message me through social media that, or LinkedIn. That's where I get most of my clients. But um, the best way is you can just set up a strategy call. A few people have done that as well. It's on my website and we can quickly, you know, just chat because I really want to serve and provide value. So that strategy call is really set up for you and, um, and to see if we're the right fit, if I can help you in any way. And again, it's, it, I work with very successful entrepreneurs and it's those blind spots. Basically, there's nothing new I teach you or something you've never heard of. It's more like tapping into those blind spots and really finding yourself again and, and having that laser focus and then going and dominating after what you want. So um, either my website strategy call or social media, both work. So that's how awesome. people can reach and I think me. And then we work like this, sorry, online. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> just say, I just think it's really interesting that you pointed that out because we do all have those blind spots. No matter how yeah. successful that you become, you mm -hmm. always have blind spots that seems really apparent sometimes to someone else, but they're yes. blind spots to you because yes. that's what they're called, right? You don't exactly. see them or you don't think about them. <laughs> Or you don't think they're as important as maybe they are too. So sometimes mm -hmm. having that, that person that can work with you and identify those is, is super, super important. So, well, you know, I absolutely adore you. And I'm so thankful that you joined me on Outside the Box with Sherry. I appreciate you, Lydia, and everything that you do. And I love that we both get to empower humans in this world to really shine and just show up and go up. Uh, like it, it fills it. my heart uh, anytime I talk to you and I hope people will connect with you. You have an amazing message and you're a very powerful woman. So I thank you so much for being a guest today. Thank you so much, Sherry. You have a wonderful day. I appreciate you so much. Like I said, your beautiful blue eyes and smile just light up my day. So I really appreciate you having me here. Uh, 
Thank you so much. And if anyone watching would like to be a guest on Outside the Box with Sherry, because you are just crushing it in the world and making a difference and serving and impacting people, just reach out to me at sherry at sherryleopold.com. And we'll see if you might be the next guest on Outside the Box with Sherry. Everybody have a great day. We'll see you next week. Hey, everybody. Sherry Leopold here. I'm so excited.